Good afternoon, this is Brett Hayworth for Siouxland Public Media News. State officials are accepting public comment on proposed rules for implementing Iowa's fetal heartbeat abortion ban, so people are encouraged to weigh in. Iowa's law that bans abortions after about six weeks of pregnancy is held up in court and cannot be enforced for now. But state officials are still carrying out the task of detailing specifically how doctors must follow the law if it takes effect, so that's why the public comment period started on Wednesday. Iowans can submit comments on the proposed rules at rules.iowa.gov. If a patient seeks an abortion under the exceptions for rape or incest, the rules would require doctors to get details about those incidents and log that information into the patient's medical record. The rules also would require a doctor to certify that a fetal abnormality is incompatible with life in order to provide an abortion under that exception. In other news, construction crews are making some progress on the much-delayed Woodbury County Law Enforcement Center a few county supervisors shared during their weekly meeting Tuesday. Some necessary work was overlooked and not included in the original plans. Therefore, the new jail building didn't open in September, so the projected date is now April 2024. Law Enforcement Center Authority members presented documents showing 34 aspects of the facility's construction are complete. Eight other parts of the construction are less than 90% complete, while eight other building portions are less than 90% complete. County Supervisors Mark Nelson and Keith Raddick toured the building last week, and Raddick said the computer and security systems are close to completion. Both said they're impressed by the new security features that are a step up from the current building, which is a downtown Sioux City facility that dates to 1987. For Siouxland Public Media News, I'm Brett Hayworth.